Well, after plenty of pre-match anticipation, the wait is finally over. My name is Derek Ray. I'm joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a spectacular final. It is Manchester City up against Inter. The instructions will have been clear from the managers, Derek. Stick to the game plan. Don't take risks in your defending third and embrace the occasion. Don't be frightened of it. What a game this should be. Number 16, Rodri. Number 17, Kevin De Bruyne. Number 8, Ilkay Gundogan. Number 47. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Ilkay Gundogan plays with Kevin De Bruyne in the center of midfield. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. The Inter starting lineup. Samir Handanovic begins in goal. Nicolo Barella plays alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Romelu Lukaku starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. is underway Diesch Erling Haaland he's in here well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it brilliantly, didn't he? Top stuff from the keeper. Lukaku. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Well, we have to say, Stuart, respect and admiration grows for Kevin De Bruyne with each passing year. So many attributes. What are you looking for from him in this game? Oh, can he finish it here, Derek? Goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. Keen to take it short here. Martinez. Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. So the corner played into the box and it wasn't the easiest header to control but still he'll be a bit disappointed Rodri it's with Gundogan Moving into the advanced position. Martinez! Oh, there is the goal that gives Inter the lead in the final. Exactly what they were hoping for. Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. On they go again. A wake-up call for the City players, maybe. Can they find a response now? Opportunity it is. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Well, the pass not finding its target.
And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. Inter have given away possession. And room now out on the wing. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. A oh, terrific pass. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Gozens. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. Given away by Inter. City move it forward with purpose. Over the touchline from what will be an Inter throw. Gozens. Nicely timed tackle. And running it back. Holland, real chance. And top notch as well as brave goalkeeping. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Might be a chance here. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. And a short corner here. And with that, the first half comes to an end here at Wembley Stadium. And this so back in business, the second half underway, and City trying to plot a route back into this one. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Holland. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, Inter couldn't hang on to it. He's in behind. And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Rodri and Grealish well timed his challenge magnificently Lukaku getting in there to intercept Martinez Martinez well clearly in the mood to make it a double but fine goalkeeping. Well, he's playing really well today. That was another decent attempt. It's a short corner. Cross could be useful. Plus it away. Now, what 
can they produce on the flank? And just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. Brozovic. Martinez. And it's won by Emerick Laporte. Holland. Well, that effort was always going wide. He's not going to be best pleased with himself. So a personnel change then. Brozovic. Martinez. Chances on. Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Lukaku, surely, and a decent save for credit. Delivering it. Wonderful header, and that is a defender doing his job, clearing it off the line. Foden. He's in here. Can he convert? Oh, blocked it. Holland could reduce the deficit. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Chalanolu. Romelu Lukaku now. And a strong tackle. And it comes down to the final five minutes. Lukaku. Dzeko. Disappointing pass. And he has options available. But the danger averted for now. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Chalanoru. Options in the centre. Can he convert? Terrific block. Taken short. Terrific block. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff.
There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. And really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.